The lower third project allows you to dynamically change the content of text and image items by feeding them with data from Live Manager program. We will start this example by creating a lower third project. After clicking on New Project button, we will choose Lower Third Type from the Wizard dialog. After creating the project, a corresponding entry will appear in the project's list. The project already contains two 2D text items. Having the same characteristics as a 2D text those items can be modified as such. In order to be able to dynamically change the content, each text item has already assigned a TCP IP variable. We will start the Live Manager by clicking on the corresponding icon. The entry for the lower third project and the corresponding items will appear in the Live Manager. We can edit each text and the modification will show in the CG after clicking play or refresh buttons of the Live Manager. We can also add to the project an image item that can be controlled from Live Manager. After dragging the image from toolbar and dropping in preview, cancel the file selecting dialog and set TCP IP variable in the second dialog. You may want to set the hold stage of the image item to match the characteristics of the rest of the items by disabling the infinite loop property. After saving the project and clicking on refresh button of the CG, the Live Manager shows the corresponding columns in the grid, allowing to edit text and to preview the selected images. The images can be taken only from a signed folder. For changing the folder, go to the properties of the project. As a conclusion, the project and the content can be fully controlled from the Live Manager.